what's going on? It is Amy again with Bargain Mama, and I am showing you, oh, sorry guys, a couple more of the items that I picked up for my, um, so this is going to be a mixture of Big Lots, Dollar General, and Walgreens. Walgreens had amazing deals. Amazing. Let me start with that one. I could not believe it. I went in and picked up my husband and I's prescriptions, and it's these are falling and you guys know what happened last time something fell I broke but you all so these are normally I think it said seven something I thought I left my receipt in here normally seven something I got it for a dollar ninety nine um there was no limit so I got three but I think when after the end of my thing it said I saved like fifty four dollars before I put my card in it was seventy five dollars and it went down to like thirty five insane but anyway, so this is just the Arm & Hammer, um, 15 ounces. Oh my gosh, it smells so good. I've not been able to find the ones at the Dollar Tree, but I will take this. Again, I paid $1.99. They said this is normally seven something. I will go without it before I pay that. So again, I got three of them and they were $1.99 each, which I think is amazing. And then this right here is 33.5 ounces and they had all of the different um, Arm & Hammers, like this one's OxyClean, this one's Odor Boosters, they had the regular one. These were all also $1.99, which they said they were normally seven something. And I was like, seven something? I think Tide is cheaper than that, I don't know. I have so much laundry soap right now that I haven't bought any in a while, thank goodness. But when I saw these for $1.99, I had to get them. So I got three or four of these. Again, it was at, um, Walgreens for $1.99. I think that's a great deal. Okay, so let's move on to Big Lots. Sorry, I'm in a hurry, just trying to get stuff done before, um, you know, everyone gets here. So I did pick this up for my nephew. Again, if you watched my last video, I'm getting them like a couple big presents, but then I'm just also getting them a little bag of stuff. And he loves, loves um, Video games, and so this was $3.99. It's called the Big Yummy Gummy Blue Raz Gamer, 5.29 ounces, and it's just like a PlayStation remote. And it's just a gummy that's huge. So I picked him that up. I picked these up for me. They were by the cash register. They're $1.99, and they're the Kind Simple Crunch Peanut Butter, only eight ingredients, five packs of two granola bars. And so $1.99 is a really good deal. So I picked those up. I picked these up just for fun. These are the nickel nips, and you bite them, break them, chew them. I remember these from when I was little. I used to love them. They were $1.49. I used to chew on this wax until it got like all crumbly in my mouth. Oh, like, yeah. So I picked these up just because I thought they would be fun. I did pick up this cotton candy. I don't remember how much this was. Fun Sweets Cotton Candy Vanilla Snow because I'm going to use this my kids are right there, on my house. I'm super excited. So this is, it says fat free. This thing has so much sugar and stuff. It's six ounces of cotton candy. So I got that. Then I did just pick up some marshmallows. This one was 99 cents. And they're Jet Puff, eight ounces. And they're the flat ones, which I've never seen the flat ones. They're called Stackers, but I thought Stackers, yes. And so I picked them up for the gingerbread houses. I would never use these in a s'more because I love, my favorite part of the s'more is the marshmallow. I want a big, fat, fluffy marshmallow. But these were 99 cents, so I picked them up. And then you always have to have the small ones. So these are 10 ounces and $1.49 for the pack of the mini marshmallows by Jet Puff for our gingerbread houses. And they also, if you watched my last one, I told you guys, um, they had, um, Walmart had their stuff like 25% off and stuff. Um, Big Lots already had their stuff um, on different sales also. So I thought that was crazy when I'm dropping everything. So I picked these up on my way to the register. They were like 33 cents each and my youngest son is always asking for chapstick. And so this is just citrus orange lip balm. It's just a little chap ice, it's 30 something cents. This one is key lime. And they are small, what are they? 0 0.10 ounces. And they were 30 something cents each. And this is cherry. So I just picked those up because they were there. Now their icing and stuff was buy one, get one half off. And so this one was 250 and this is 250, so 125, so 350, 375 for both of these. So, anyways, this is four icing pens, but this is shimmer. 
So I liked that it was shimmer. I think that's awesome. Now, will you bring me in an ultra, please? And then this one right here is just called Cozy Christmas. So this has white, brown, scarlet, and everything. So this is just the regular icing. So I picked up that one. Again, those were buy one, get one half off. This was 25% off, so $3, I don't know. But I love, you guys know I love the elf. So I picked this up just because I think he's so cute. And it is 22 pieces. So I picked that up. And I think that is all for the big lot. And let me put everything back in here. I know I'm trying to go fast, but I just want to show you guys what I got at this missed the bag. At the same time as be ready when everyone gets here. So now we are moving on to Dollar General. And there is just a couple bags in here. I can see my son looking outside. The dog I call Goliath must be like coming over the wall. Like that dog is no joke. I will tell you the prices on the ones I can remember. These are just the holiday pretzels. And they are 3.5 ounces. I got two of them. And is the dog over the wall? Goliath. And they are a dollar each. So I picked those up. These are for more for me to eat. I love those. Um, I picked up two of these. And they're called Rips. And they're 3.5 ounces. And they are bite-sized licorice pieces. No, you can't have it right now. No, you can't. No, these are for walkways and paths in our village. Well, eight people are going to use just the one bag? Good. Don't get all mad. Go take a shower, and then we'll, you can eat it while we're doing the thing. This is 10 ounces, and these are just the holiday spice sets. I do not like these, but you cannot have a gingerbread house without these. So I was looking everywhere for these. I finally found them at the Dollar General. So I picked those up. I did just pick up the 35 mini candy canes by Brock's. Again, this is something I feel like is a staple in your um, candy cane or candy whatever making endeavors. I did pick up one package of five ounces of the hot tamales. You all, let me tell you, we are probably not even going to need the walls for these houses because of all the candy I bought. There is so much candy. I picked up five ounces and these are the Smarties. Or, yes, you guessed it, our gingerbread houses. I picked up three of the regular M&Ms, 2.55 ounces, three of them. Now, I went around the store and I compared, like, if these were a better deal or if the, they didn't have any in the boxes. But, like, if the bags, like the family bags and stuff were a better deal, and this was actually a better deal, so that's why I picked them up in the smaller packages. And then, so those were a dollar each. And then this is two of the peanut M&Ms. To be honest, the only reason I got these is because I like to eat these and I don't like regular M&Ms. And so I was like, mm, I'll just get these to eat them. So, yeah. These, this was a dollar. These are the Reese's Pieces, four ounces. Okay, so my son is not here. You all. I plan on building like a tree house type gingerbread house. I shouldn't tell you because if it doesn't come through, that's not what I'm going to have. But I want to build like a tree house gingerbread house and have like smoke, aka cotton candy coming out the top. Like I have been Googling and researching for a while. And I told everyone, you better do your research because I'm not playing around. I think they thought I was playing. I'm not. And then the last things I did pick up are these Pirellines. Um, the dark chocolate cream filled wafers too, and they were a dollar each. And these I saw, um, you use them like underneath your tree house, like to look like trees, the branches. Oh guys, I got this. I got this. So anyways, that is my haul. Um, I'm probably going to, oh no, it's not. How did I forget? I put these here and forgot because these were on a clearance also, um, at big lots. I put them here to take them out and then I forgot. So this is by winter wonderland. This is 18 feet of the craft ribbon. And it says it was four fifty. Let me get my receipt. But again, they were having like different percentages off everything. So I think this is the first one I got. So I think I paid. Okay, so let me just show you this one because this one right here, I know. Um, this is the Arctic fur ribbon, two point five inches by nine feet, normally five dollars. And this one I did pay. Um, $3 for it. Yes. So I paid $3 for this and I paid $2.70 for this. I think that's amazing when I do my crafting for whenever or whatever I do. I think these are amazing deals. So that is all guys. I cannot wait to show you guys the pictures of our gingerbread houses. 
I'm hoping I'm going to win because, you know, well, I don't think my kids took me seriously. But anyways, it's just for fun, kind of. <laughs> I hope that you guys have a great day, and I'll talk to you later. Bye, guys.